A day the Gulf Coast won't soon forget. August 29, 2005. Hurricane Katrina and the flooding that followed devastates New Orleans. Tulane University, home to thousands of students, was underwater. We, we all cried first, and then we realized, you know, that we really needed to get started on rebuilding the campus. Tulane made the bold decision it would reopen in five months, a decision that seemed almost impossible. A lot of their mechanical and electrical equipment was in basements, and that was totally devastated. It was very challenging to get contractors to show up, to, you know, to sit there with us. Johnson Controls, the folks that we had been working with for years, never left the table. Tulane is the anchor institution in this city, and the day we opened in January, the population in the city grew by 20% alone. Now, 10 years later, much has changed. With the help of a $1 million commitment from Johnson Controls, Tulane's School of Architecture launched a program that improves the city one project at a time. The City Center was an idea after the storm to really get students and faculty plugged into community-based projects. Every year, students use the money for revitalization projects. Parasite Skate Park started as an underground project that youth in the city were building in their spare weekends, and we helped them figure out a way to legitimize their efforts and be seen as the city's first official skate park. It is amazing, in neighborhoods that in some instances have been devastated and seem like they have no hope, that design and, and humility and passion can come together. It builds a sense of optimism. Parasite is a great example. Grodat is also a fantastic example. Grodat Youth Farm employs and teaches students how to grow healthy food for local residents. And so that's planting, that's weeding, that's harvesting, learning about uh, the different food systems and in food and in plants you can see the cycle of life. I think that's why it's important because we're focused on the future but working every day toward that. There is a renewal that comes about out of disaster. Today I'd say Tulane is an even more vital institution uh, than it was 10 years ago and I think more importantly New Orleans is really a very different city.